Hello, welcome to uh, a mishmash of a video. This is an update, a channel update, and a kind of mail day on packaging. Um, yeah, so I'm going to open this, but before I get to that, very quick channel update, and this is where you realise that you can never trust me. It wasn't a few videos ago where I said I was going to be doing no more updates on this channel, but doing them on my No Stay Reproductions channel. I know, um, I guess that was a failed experiment because, um, you know, I have literally over a thousand percent more subscribers on this channel so those are the people who are going to probably want to know about you know updates to my channel so whatever it is what it is um, and it's a, it was a failed experiment like a lot of things I've done so basically um, I had a bad week last week had a really bad day and a bad couple of days and it was just really hard to get motivated to make videos um, I'm not under the um, delusion that people are kind of waiting every day for one of my videos, but yeah, that's why I took a kind of a couple of days break. Also, I'm working on the Blu-ray Brothers channel. If you haven't seen the Blu-ray Brothers channel, it's me uh, and Robbie Webster and Ryan Chataway, two American YouTubers, two great friends, two great YouTubers, uh, two of my favorites. So it's awesome to be working alongside them on some fun videos. You know, we've been doing some skits, and you know, every review we do, we do like a little skip uh, before it, just to make it more fun and for people to kind of um, want to tune in every time for a video. Um, it's been the first week has, has been and gone. We're starting the second week now, which is Western weeks. So we'll be reviewing Western movies. My Western review goes up tomorrow. I'll be talking about all three of the Dollar Trilogy movies, along with a little skit of my own as well. And um, so look forward to that if you're watching that channel already. If you're not, go check it out. It's a lot of fun, and we're also doing a contest on our Facebook page, which uh, more people should get involved in, I think, because it's a fun way to win a cool Blu-ray set. So go check out the Blu-ray Brothers uh, Facebook page as well at facebook.com forward slash Blu-ray Bros. And you can just kind of um, answer questions and stuff and get points. And whoever has the most points at the end of the you know the time we designate will win the Blu-ray set. Anyway, so I have a couple of videos to come this week. Um, uh, I have... Another Star Wars video. I've been really trying to keep up with the Road to Episode 7 series, but it's just um, with so many other things going on, it's hard to keep up. But I'm going to try and get a couple of those out um, over the next week or so because there's a couple of things we want to talk about about Star Wars Episode 7. And uh, I'm starting two new series, which is terrible. It's like I'm addicted to, to starting video series, but luckily these ones aren't um, rash decisions because uh, they won't take any uh, effort because um, basically. I'm going to be doing two series which will have no editing, you know, no pictures edited in, no skits, nothing, just straight reviews of uh, what the series are about. The first one is The Simpsons. I've started watching The Simpsons from episode one again, so I'm going to be watching that. Uh, well, I have been watching that. I'm on the second season now. Me and Connie, my fiance, have been watching every episode, and I, I just want to watch all of them. I want to watch every episode until present day because I've never really judged. You know, people say that uh, you know The Simpsons is is terrible, and uh, you know, the last few seasons or the last 10 years or whatever, people have said that it's been terrible, but I want to judge for myself and see some of those newer episodes, those newer seasons, and see just how bad they really are. I'm still a huge Simpsons fan, and it's a joy right now to watch all the uh, old episodes, which are just fantastic, and I have the first six seasons here on DVD. I was thinking about reviewing the DVDs, but I haven't got the packages with me, just the, the discs, so I'll just be doing reviews of, the, you know, brief maybe 10 minute review of each season, that kind of thing, So, and, and they'll be sporadic, I mean it could take years, I don't know, we'll see how long it takes us to get through them all, but that's the series I'll be starting this week because I've already watched the first season, and another series will be called The Pink Floyd Journey where I'll be reviewing every um, studio album that Pink Floyd has released, my favourite band of all time, and I'm really taking a risk here, a gamble, in making a series about music which I've never done before, I've never reviewed music before, um, but you know, I always say variety is the spice of my channel, and uh, you know, the same way as Aaron Eisrak has said that in the past, because I, I do whatever I want, and I'm enjoying look, listening to the music again and reviewing them. Um, so that'll be debuting this week as well, and it'll be all in the lead up to the new Pink Floyd album in October, which is still crazy to think of. Um, but yeah, um, it's really. I hope people watch it and enjoy it, but I'm 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 aware that it probably you know won't be watched that much. And again. To people who just watch me for the movies, um, please stay subscribed because there'll be tons more videos to come. Uh, so yeah. Oh, and there'll be a, a separate video to anyone who's who's hoping to hear about it in this video. I'm sorry. There will be an update on the Harry Potter Odyssey, which is a series I started back in 2012, and it's really quite something that people still remember that and still want me to continue it. And I'll well, I'll let you know now that I'm definitely continuing it very soon, and there'll be a whole dedicated video maybe even going up today or tomorrow talking about the update of that series so let's get right into this package now from Amazon very quickly and I'll show you what I've got um, yeah, this, the package is very ropey and delivery to Norway was ridiculous they've really upped the prices on delivery which is terrible I think um, but you know it is what it is what are you gonna do um, let's get all the stuff out and there are two blu-rays 
and uh, they're in fine condition, it's fine, um, even though the uh, the packaging was quite flimsy. So very quickly I've got one minute battery left. I have Fritz Lang's M, Massive Cinema, these are both Massive Cinema releases, I love the Eureka series, Massive Cinema, and I'm a huge Fritz Lang fan so I can't wait to watch this film, which I think was his first uh, sound film, and uh, you know, considered one of the greatest films ever made, and you know, I've seen a lot of Fritz Lang's films by now, and I haven't seen this one, so I'm dying to see it. I actually already own the Criterion, if you can believe that. I'm kicking myself and never having watched it, even though I've had it for two years, but it's back home now and I can't watch it. So I got the UK release because it's just as good as the Criterion one. It's got loads of extras on it, and I've heard the transfer is pretty much the same. So comment to check out M. And then finally, I have uh, Sunrise. I think it's uh, the, the full title was A Song of Two Humans, which I believe uh, won an Oscar in... Uh, the, the first uh, Academy Awards. It wasn't the best picture Oscar, it was like uh, Oscar for um, artistic film or something like that. So, Sunrise, this is number one in the Massive Cinema series. My hands are so shaky because I'm so hot. Um, but yeah, I cannot wait to check this one out and I will be, and talking about it on the Blue Air Brothers channel in a couple of weeks, which is giving away what our theme will be, but there you go. Two awesome Massive Cinema releases from uh, an Amazon gift card I got for my birthday. So uh, yeah, awesome stuff and um, Hope you enjoyed this quick update. It's a bit scrambled because I only had six minutes on the battery. So, thank you for watching. I'll see you next time. He says he's really cool, but I think he's a tool. <laughs> <laughs> Even though I'm sure he's a quite nice guy, really. <laughs> he's a quite nice guy, really.